uh, next year. And uh, I'm gonna make a basically a robot to show uh, what you can do with Mindstorms. Um, and also to show that you can in fact use Mindstorms to make a very compact robot for mm. playing football. Mm. Uh, a football playing robot. Because mm. there were some real uh, some restraints, it has to fit inside 22 centimeters, a ring of 22 centimeters. The ball can't be inside the robot more than two centimeters, so there's a lot of restraints, which makes it quite a challenge to, uh, to, to build a robot that can do all that. And uh, robust, uh, as it has to, as a as be strong as well. Uh, yeah, that too, because they're going to smash into each other, yeah, of course. Exactly. And uh, the nice thing about this platform, if you look at the wheels, they're quite different. Oh, yeah. They can. Uh, this is rolls oh, yeah, freely, they, yeah, yeah, yeah. and it allows the robot to basically yeah. roll in any yeah, yeah, any, direction. any direction it likes. Yeah, okay. And uh, I've been playing with platforms like that for about two and a half years now mm -hmm. and uh, it went from really big to sort of smaller and smaller and I actually helped uh, Australian company uh, develop these wheels adapt them they were it, are they in, a produ in production now yes in they are production? and um, they were in fact uh, for industrial purposes uh -huh. for a very large conveyor belts okay and uh, they contacted me and said hey we're interested in making this work with Lego mm -hmm. and uh, I said yeah sure mm -hmm. uh, I, I don't mind helping you so we uh, we developed uh, the, in, the, the little uh, things inside yeah. and um, they um, modified the production process to make these wheels more uh, mm. smoothly oh, yeah. because you know on a conveyor belt when the little wheel doesn't roll very smoothly and there's 25 kilos on it mm. it doesn't matter yeah. but if it's a robot that yeah, weighs yeah. only 400 yeah. grams yeah, your yeah. robot's gonna go left instead of right that's for sure <laughs> <So>. <laughs> now,